I couldn't believe what I was seeing, if I'm honest, because I had high expectations because Paul's involved in it, so I knew it was going to be good. But, but I didn't think it would actually look like a gr real movie that you could walk into. I mean, how is that possible for people to make a movie of this standard themselves? But it, it obviously is. So my first impression was, wow, this is like a real, this is a real movie that could win major awards anywhere in the world. Surprise, uh, delight. Uh, I, I, I mean, I didn't know that the budget was, uh, was minus something or other. And uh, I, I expected um, you know, something passable maybe with that budget, but uh, I'm just delighted with the, 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 uh, the quality of it. Um, actually, I was bowled over with the quality of it. Admiration, jealousy, that's a Wexford thing. I was a little jealous that I wasn't somehow involved in it. But, but mainly admiration. I don't think we've seen anything quite like this. Well, we have seen uh, things like this before, but it's been a long time. It's, it has universal themes uh, of love, of loss, of ambition, of that feeling of being stuck and that you just cannot get out of where you are. So I think anyone who watches this movie would be touched by it. We, we certainly were looking at a, a new voice from cinema. I think Paul has found his, uh, has found his niche now. And to see all that encapsulated in such a beautiful and lush uh, package, it's, it's kind of irresistible. It needs to be backed, it needs to be supported and, um, and cheered on. And uh, what a wonderful debut, brilliant.